Here at Missouri s t one of the four signature areas is advanced manufacturing. We have performed lots of uh, nationally and internationally well-known research in areas such as additive manufacturing, composite manufacturing, machine tool, error compensation, and uh, micro nano manufacturing. At Missouri s t we have a research project to improve the accuracy of industrial robots. Robots are known to be very repeatable, but not accurate. Usually the industry uses very expensive and complex sensors. We have a very different approach by calibrating robots using a laser tracker, which measures the robot end effector position at a sequence of points within the work envelope. One of the laser-based additive manufacturing processes is selective laser centering, where the laser beam is directed to center material particles in a powder bed to make three-dimensional parts from computer-aided design models. We have used this process to build various components for aerospace, biomedical, and energy applications. Our aim in the center is to predict and prevent rather than fail and fix methodology. Yeah, no, I think that's perfect. Primarily, we look at how things fail and how to predict those failures. So one of the projects that we are doing right now is sensors. The top one is essentially the chip that uh, we designed. It has an accelerometer sensor, a temperature sensor, a humidity sensor. It can transmit the information wirelessly. It can be useful to track objects around a manufacturing shop floor environment. This particular device is essentially being placed on a part, and as the part moves from one location to the other, it periodically sends some signal. It has uh, the device that is like a satellite on the roof. It sends a ping, and that ping is used by this device to generate a signal back to the device in the roof. And by monitoring the ping from this device from three different locations, we essentially can locate the object in a three-dimensional environment. When you're talking about manufacturing, there are any number of issues related to security. Typically, that is focused around concepts involving the cyber physical system. So what I do as part of my research is to think about emergent behaviors. If I make this change, then what cascading change is going to happen as a result of that? And so in essence, what we do, rather than work with uh, some sort of piece of equipment, is in our minds, then we will draw forth the components. We often will sit around a whiteboard and talk about the way each system ultimately connects with either another or with its own subsystems. We really, I think, have done a phenomenal job of pulling together strengths across all of the areas that we have on campus. Not only do we have engineering, but we have computer science. We have the social sciences represented. Injection molding is a process where a material, usually a thermoplastic, is fed into a chamber. Well, it is melted and injected by pressure to a cavity and then solidifies into a part in the geometry of the cavity. Laser micro machining is a process where high speed laser, such as nanosecond laser or femtosecond laser, is directed on a material to remove material in the micro scale in order to make optical sensors that can survive extremely high temperature and corrosive environments. The Center for Aerospace Manufacturing Technologies was established in partnership with Boeing with strong support from the Air Force Research Laboratory. We are very eager to work with more companies in the future to improve their manufacturing competitiveness through improving product quality or manufacturing productivity. We also have received so many different patents for different technologies we have developed for autonomous systems, diagnostics and prognostics, sensor development. We also have patents on the supply chain management and forecasting. When we were asked to do a vibration as a source to generate energy, we looked at commercially available devices and we developed a way to generate energy 10 times more than any commercially available hardware in the market. Mm -hmm.